You're watching WMAR 2 News. With this digital news update, I'm Kelly Swoop. Gas prices are going down across the state. They're at about $4.92 a gallon. That is nine cents over the past week. But in just over a week, most of those gains will be canceled out. On July 1st, the state's gas tax will rise 18%. That's about seven cents a gallon. Governor Hogan wants to pause that increase and start up another gas tax holiday. In a statement, he said he is ready to sign a gas tax suspension into law, adding he'd like to get it done before the 4th of July holiday in less than two weeks. While the governor wants a gas tax holiday, the head of the state and the Senate and the House don't. In May, Senate President Bill Ferguson and Speaker Adrian Jones said it wouldn't happen as it would impact funds to repair state roads and bridges. And on the national stage, President Biden is looking to pause federal gas taxes for at least the next three months. His plan would save the average driver 18 cents a gallon for regular gas and 24 cents for diesel. Congress would need to approve the federal tax break. If it does pass, it would mean less money for infrastructure projects across the country. And now from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. I'm tracking some lingering showers for the start of your Thursday, but those showers will start to clear out as we head into the afternoon. Still tracking partly to mostly cloudy skies for most of the day, and that's going to keep temperatures down in the 70s for the afternoon. I expect us to top out near 75 here in Baltimore. Low 70s near the Mason-Dixon line, 75 down in Easton. And as we head into your Friday, we're looking at more sunshine breaking through the clouds. Temperatures climbing closer to average, but still a a little shy of it and then we're flirting with 90 for the weekend with another chance of showers and storms on Monday. Stick with us online at WMER2news.com. We'll bring you updates on our top stories and follow breaking news. And for news and weather while you're on the go, don't forget to download our WMER2news app in your app store. Thanks for watching. I'm Kelly Swoop.